there's a tweet by CZ talking about um, this major update here as you can see trust wallet just did a huge release trust wallet browser extension okay so um, what I'm gonna be doing in this video is to show you how you can add this new trust wallet uh, browser extension on your mobile device okay you can do this on your desktop laptops okay it's easier to do on those uh, devices but I'm gonna be showing you how you can also easily do it on your mobile device okay if you want to know how you can do this let's jump right into this video but please note this is simply for education only and nothing more okay so for this process to work what you would do would be to go to your Google Play Store and uh, download this browser here the kiwi browser once you have this browser downloaded um, then you would have to run the browser by clicking on the open button so that's going to bring you to this place what we actually want to do is to um, add the trust wallet extension to this browser so if you click on these three dots we want the trust wallet extension to be somewhere here okay so um let's go ahead and do this so what you're gonna do now is to uh, go to the description of this video you're gonna see a link down there that link you're gonna paste it here so once you have the link in the description of this video you're watching copied you're gonna come here and paste it and then you're gonna search that link so that link is going to bring you to this page here and this is the official uh, trustwallet.com uh, browser extension page right so once you're here you can see all of the information here so what you're going to do is to scroll down here and um, read all of the information okay so you can see where it says um, get the trust wallet extension so you're gonna click on this button but before you do this you're gonna come to these three dots here and click it so you click it and then you're gonna come to this place where we've got a desktop you're gonna click on this button here and make sure it gets ticked in blue like this and then once you do that then you are gonna come back to the um get the extension again and then you're gonna click uh the button so the next thing you would have to do would be to click on the add to chrome button so you click on that and then it shows you this so it says add trust wallet okay so you're gonna click on the ok button here and then as you can see up here it says check in now you can see uh the extension has been added you can see it says remove from chrome okay once you have this display in here that means you've um, successfully added the new trust wallet extension to your kiwi browser on your mobile device okay so usually this would be done on your uh, computer on your laptop but we're doing it on our mobile device so if you click on these three dots now you're gonna see that you've done this so you can see this display so all you need to do is to scroll up here so you can see that down here that we've uh, added the extension you can see it down here where it says trust wallet okay so you have successfully added the trust wallet extension so you can click on that trust wallet extension so as you can see i've chosen a password of my choice making sure i meet these uh, criteria here so i'm gonna check this little box here and then i'm gonna click on the proceed button now as you can see i'm in the second phase of the process it says back up your secret phrase you'll be shown a secret phrase on the next screen it allows you to recover your wallet even if you lose your device or forget your password okay so what you're gonna do is if you're doing this with me you're gonna have a piece of paper or a notebook and um, make sure you're ready to write your secret recovery phrase this is gonna be your way to get access to your wallet if you um forget your password okay or you want to log into your wallet okay so this will be very very important and make sure you're writing it where you would never forget or misplace okay so uh let's click on the next button so now you can see um, the words are displayed here um, if I click on the got it button that means I'm gonna be uh, displaying it okay so because this is a, a tutorial so I'm gonna be um, displaying this 
so these are the words what i'm gonna do now would be to click on the copy button okay but for you you would have to pen these words down okay in the same exact order right so once you're done you're gonna click on the proceed button so on the next phase as you can see i am asked to confirm those uh, words right so i would have to um make sure that i am selecting these words in the right order right again i have uh, selected all of them in the right order okay i'm showing this because this is a tutorial i'm not gonna be using this wallet for any meaningful thing okay so make sure you are not showing your seed phrase like this okay so i'm gonna click on the next button so as you can see now it says congratulations your wallet has been created okay so if i want to open my wallet i'm gonna click on the open button so that brings me to this place you can see the information here how to access dApps with trust wallet okay uh, i don't need this information now okay you might want to read it so here is my wallet okay i have opened my trust wallet on my kiwi browser now okay if you want to log into your trust wallet um you would need to key in your password so remember the password you created when you were creating the account you key in, in here and then you would click on the unlock button and you'll be able to log in so let's do that so i've keyed in my password all i'll do now would be to click on the unlock button and boom i'm logged in again okay so this is how this works okay so but there are a few things i want to make sure you pay close attention to okay if you're using your trust wallet on any browser extension you need to be very careful not to fall prey to phishing attacks okay so you need to be very security conscious not to make that mistake if you fall prey to a phishing attack while on your kiwi browser or your chrome browser irrespective of the browser you've added this extension to you could lose all your asset okay so make sure that um, if you're using a browser extension like this that you only have a very small amount of money on the wallet or something you want to use to do a very quick transaction and you're done never leave your entire assets on a browser extension like this if you mistakenly click on the wrong link okay so this is it for this video this is Brixel Bees and it's your guy Ken signing off